time of year when you want your garden and landscaping to shine. And this morning, we've got more from uh, Allisonville Garden and Home, and we're going to show everyone how to build these beautiful fairy gardens. We've got uh, Shannon, right? It's Sharon. Sharon, Sharon, thank you so much for Good coming morning, in. Good morning, Naomi. Good morning to you. If you wouldn't mind talking us through why these have become so popular, fairy gardens, really. Yeah. Yeah, so um, we started at Allisonville Nurseries about five years ago, and we had a really small fairy department, and it's grown, and we've got a massive okay. room to it now, and everybody loves doing it. It doesn't matter whether you're young, you're old, you're male, you're female, grandparents do it with grandchildren, you can do it inside, outside, if you've got a really small little house, you can have a little fairy garden, have one on your office, on your table. Yeah, and so we've beautiful. So we've got some examples, so you can build them in anything, a okay. little basket, a pot, maybe a, a tin, something from around the house. This one's really zen. It's, uh, it doesn't, yes. if, if you're not really into fairies, but you want a miniature garden and sort of want to kind of go the zen, cooling. Yeah, because some people might not be into the fairy piece of it, but they like the idea. Absolutely, absolutely. So you can just use something really calming, um, lovely green little yeah, fluffy plants. So it, it has a sort of Japanese feel to it. It's beautiful. Yeah, and then and then obviously traditional fairy garden for inside, little ferns for the fairies to hide under, um, water, fairies love water, we've got some water in there, pretty little plants, and they're so easy, so easy. Yeah, and you're going to show us actually how to make one here. And very, very before quickly. Before we do that, I want you to mention there's a special holiday coming up, right? On the 24th of July is National Fairy Day, so um, everybody needs to build a fairy garden to attract right? attract a fairy into yes. it. <laughs> okay, so show us how to build our garden at home. Very simple. I've got a little container. In the bottom, I've put some, some stones just to help with um, drainage. It. Yeah, okay. I've put some active um, carbon in the bottom just to keep, again, mm -hmm. the drainage right. And then I put a little mesh square over the top of that to stop the dirt that I've put in. And we so use that's the hard part <coughs> we've already done for you. Absolutely. <laughs> One that I created earlier. Yes. Um, we use peat moss in there. Okay. Then once we've done all of that, I put in a little pond. As I said, fairies love water it's to attract yeah. them. And then we have loads of these little sweet plants. Okay, so you take it out of the pot. Out of the pot. I use um, a little wooden spoon okay. just to make my holes. And I'm building in a little tray to stop putting mess everywhere. And you just make your little hole, pop it in, Firm your plant down. Ooh, it looks beautiful. Move the soil back around it. This is like gardening light. It I is think, gardening right? light. Okay. Yeah, absolutely. You know, it, it, that's where, where you can do it with your children. I mean, so much fun to come and choose all right, the little plants. Right. Um, I like to put in a little house to attract a yeah. fairy. So we've got a huge selection of houses. So let's put a little little house and in I there. And I see down here. <coughs> now your fairy has to find you, so obviously. <laughs> okay, so I just pick a spot just, to put yeah, her. She can sit anywhere, wherever oh, she maybe likes with her to feet sit. in the pond. Yeah, and little sparkles. Fairies like sparkly oh, nice. things, so if you just put some little sparkles in there. Beautiful. It makes it really pretty. And well, so thank simple. you so much for coming. We appreciate it. And again, uh, International Fairy Day is coming up, so this is a Friday good Friday the 24th. Perfect. Thank you so much for coming in. We appreciate thank it. Thank you.